Hello, hello, hello everyone and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me here in a brand new game for the channel. The Walking Dead, the game. It's another Telltale game. You guys seem to really have liked the Jurassic Park game, so I thought we'd keep it rolling here with uh, The Walking Dead. It's an older game. It's been out for a while. Uh, I actually played this when it first came out, so I kind of remember some of it. But this will be a good trip down memory lane for me, and I think you guys are going to enjoy the content as well. Well, so it's a little bit episodic. Uh, we'll pop over here. So there's going to be five episodes, at least in the game. I'll probably break some of these episodes up into multiple episodes. Then there's a special episode, 400 Days. And then after that, there's a couple, I think there's two other games or three other games that if this does well, we can check those out as well. And here in this photo, we can see the main character, Lee and Clementine in the background. So I'm excited for you guys to experience with, these, with this, experience this with me again. So I think that's enough talking. Let's go and hop on in and see what The Walking Dead, the game, has to offer for us. Oh, as you can see, apparently I have some saves. Wow. Um, over a year ago. Well over a year ago I played this. Let's go ahead and we'll start a new game here. Go ahead and click play there. Uh, let's see. Choose a display style. Standard, minimal. Um, we'll do, let's do standard here. Uh, just because I think that will be, that will be better. Oh god, we still got more things to pick from. Okay, so episode one, a new day. Let's go ahead and play that. So as we get going here, you know, let me know in the comments on down below what you guys are think is going to happen. I know we haven't seen anything, uh, but I'd love to hear from you guys. Let me know what's going on in your life. Anything like that, I'd love to hear about that as well. Got some uh, ominous music going on here in the background. The Walking Dead. I actually remember watching the first episode on TV when uh, they, they showed it in black and white. It was Halloween, and I can't remember what year. I was in high school when they first showed it. Got the new day again here. Zipping along in a, a cop car. So similar to the Jurassic Park game, uh, we'll be making some decisions both in how we communicate and our actions. Uh, and it's a persistent environment. So things are remembered uh, by people and the environment. So it's not like, you know, there's a, a railroad track that we will have to follow. Uh, it's uh, a little bit of a railroad track. But well, not too much. I reckon you didn't do it, Dan. All right. So what do you say that? Uh, do you know what he's reckoning? Does it really matter? Uh, let's go with. Uh, let's go with this. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually, it's about now I get the I didn't do it. Hmm. Not for me. Because guys in your position already said it enough. We got what looks like a 1091 e near Beach Tree exit 285. All cars asked to keep on the lookout for a 91 e in the area. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Let's see, are you it's got an opinion? Uh, let's go with the top one again. For making then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hmm. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? Ooh, that was a sour note there for Lee. Uh... Sure. Hmm. A little poutiness in that lip there. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Or be, could be I did, or maybe she married the wrong guy. We'll go with this one. Riot in progress. All officers are available for incoming 217. Rolling calls in 
Oh, and there's a helicopter coming by too. Things you can't control. The end of the world. The zombies are coming after Atlanta. They're building that up. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. What was that? That was a bunch of garbage on the road there? Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. <laughs> So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Uh... So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed. <laughs> stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. This is Lupin. We already saw this. People up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit What's this? Someone crossing the road. Look out. Look out. Watch out. Oof. Jesus. Holy heck. What a way to start the game though. Oh, we got some walkers outside the car already. Sounds like uh, Officer Friendly's not doing very well. Come on, Lee. Get up, Lee. Lee, wake up. Hmm, surprised they let us keep our watch there. That's a hell of a gash there. Where's the shotgun at? Uh, he did not. Oh, there's the shotgun. Okay, use the mouse to look around and find a way out of the car. So we need to look at the shotgun. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. How do we get out of the car? Okay, we're going to kick the window out. All right, another good kick there. Come on, Lee. There we go. All right, now move forward using W. I need to drag myself out that window. All right, Lee, you got this, man. All right, look at the door. Use the mouse wheel. Climb out. All right. Watch the glass. Don't cut yourself, man. Easy peasy. Oh, that's a steep embankment there. Oof. All right, using it on the car. All right, let's limp our way over there. There's the shotgun. Probably gonna need that here in a few seconds. Come on, Lee, no, get the shotgun, Lee. Uh, all right, take shotgun show. Look yeah, at shotgun. Let's go ahead and grab that shotgun in case. Looks empty. It'll yep. be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Oh, they don't want me to grab it yet. Alright, can we grab these shells over here? Let's grab these shells. That just sounds painful on the old leg there. Alright, is there anything else we can explore? We picked up the shotgun shells. Alright, let's go uh, look at the body here, see if we can get some keys off him. Take our cuffs off. Excuse me, take our cuffs off. Officer? God damn. Officer? Uh, do we gotta go around him here? There we go. There's the keys. Uh, I think we're gonna get a little jump scare here. No? I thought he'd move when we uh, tried to grab the keys there. Oh, of course. Oh. Um, hmm. Come on. Alright, let's try.
try this again. There you go, Lee. Good job. Officer. Oh, that! Whoa, 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 whoa! Come on, Lee. Come on, Lee. All right, let's get away from here. What in the hell? Yeah, it's a zombie, Lee. We need that shotgun. Get away from me! All right, let's rack around. Shoot. Get the, get the round. Come on, Lee. Rack it. All right. Oh, wow. What a shot. There she is. There she is. Clem, Clem. What's going on? Oh, we got friends coming. Alright, Lee. Time to move. Come on, get up. We gotta go. Quite a few friends. Missing a little bit of its arm there. Let's go, Lee. Come on. Hop that fence. They're going to come bursting through the fence here in a second. Some more gunfire. A lot of smoke there in the background. Alright, so we're back in control here. Can I zoom in? Alright, let's uh let's go check this treehouse out. No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This <laughs> leg the way it is. Anybody up there? No? Alright. Uh, a little tea set. Have some tea. I actually had a glass of tea before I uh, started recording here. One of those teacups with some bourbon, if I could. Help! All right. I'm. A, I think we have to get yeah into the house here. Take a dip in the pool. Maybe I'll just go for a dip. <laughs> he was thirsty. Let's drink out of the the hose there. Maybe I should just. Check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Yeah, that, that looks like that's a heck of a car accident out there. All right, let's Somebody. hobble hey, ourselves up this fence or this uh, stair here. Thirsty, Lee? Come on, you said you were thirsty. All right, let's take a peek through here. Home. I wonder if anybody's home. All right, well, we're just going to say that instead of looking. All right, let's go ahead and open the door, see what's Hello. going on. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and open it. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Ah, shit. Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. <laughs> Ooh, that doesn't look good in the kitchen. These people might need more help than I do. All right, we got a coloring book. We got some fruit. I wonder if it's fake fruit. 
A lot of blood over there. It's fake. Damn. Hmm. Jesus. There's some small f handprints in there. That's uh, not good. A little unicorn. All right, let's um, apparently slip on the blood. Oh, good. Now we're covered in blood. Um, a lot of footprints going to over there. Is that the phone ringing? Cup of water. There you go. Lee, get you a drink of water there. Let's see. Open this drawer. See if there's anything in there. No clue what that is. Ooh, a radio. That might have been what's chirping. Okay, we'll hang on to that. Nice. Oh, no, it wasn't the radio. What do we got here? Whole lot of nothing. This drawer here. More nothing. The Marshalls. That's a Savannah area code, but that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. I guess we're just going to... new messages. All right, well, we'll get to those messages in a second. I'm ransacking the cupboards. Hold on. I don't know if we're going to find anything, but my, uh, my need to know is greater than figuring out the answering machine. Whole lot of nothing. Okay, I guess we're coming, coming to answer... Or look at the answering machine. Calm down. All right, don't slip on the blood again. All right. Let's see. Look at answering machine. Let's try this. Three new messages. Message one left at 5:43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Dang. Three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Daddy? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Uh, let's go with I'm not a monster. Not a monster. Good. Uh, let's go with What's this. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Um, where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? The boats? Uh, where are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. <laughs> oh, there's Sandra. Uh, Q, 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 Q. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Lee. Come on, Lee. Oof. Don't slip. Oh, you slipped again. And, oh, you hit your head, Lee, my man. All right, um, kick. Ow, 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 ow. Come on, come on. Ooh, another solid punch. Clementine with the hammer. Ooh. 
All right, some more queuing here. Come on, come on, come on. Hammer. Oh, ho, ho. wow. Go to town, Lee. One more. Wow. Goodbye, Sandra. At least what's left of Sandra. Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Um. I think something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Two nights ago? Yeah, that's probably what happened. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Um... We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Aww. Stay close to me. God, I forgot how good this game was. The storytelling, the graphics, the action. All fantastic. Alright, let's hobble Lee's butt on over to the gate, I think. Unless we're gonna go through the garage? No. Alright, we're gonna go through the gate, where all the car accidents are at. Oh, we got someone out over there. Can I yell to them? It looks like they're trying to clear the way. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Don't want to miss hot dish night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Uh, I won't leave you alone. They won't. Uh, I right. leave you alone. Let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Hmm. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? What's going on? We're looking for we help. Need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. <laughs> I'm Sean. Sean Green. <gasps> this is Sean Green. I'll Hopefully check. you guys know who that name, the green name is. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Uh, go with a neighbor. neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. All right, time to push. Come on. A little bit more. Come on. There you go, Clem. Come on, Clem. Push. Is that it? All right, in the truck. Oof. What are those guys? Neighbors, too? 5240. 5240. She keeps looking at the address side. Uh, 
All right, I think we're almost to the... What they say? We're going to their farm? It's got to be who I think it is. We're going to find out here in a few seconds. Let me know in the comments down below if you know where we're going. I think I know where we're going. Based on the last name. Hey, Sean. I'm going to run on home. My mama's going to be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I think that's who I it is. It would be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Um, boy's a lifesaver. Boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Thank you, Clem. Coming through strong. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Oh, I think we're about to get grilled. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Hurts like hell, it's not too bad. Let's go with that. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? Uh, we'll go if it's, it's Lee. Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Yes. How'd this happen? Uh, jump in the fence. We'll go if car, car accident. accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Home out of Atlanta. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who were you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. <laughs> House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. <laughs> uh... I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. Hmm. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay. That'd be perfect. <laughs> There's blankets and such. Uh. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. All right, let's go hunker down in the barn, shall we? It smells like... Manure. Manure? <laughs> like when a horse plops? Just like that. I missed my mom and dad. 
Not a bit, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. I love you, baby. <laughs> mm. Some nightmares there, Lee. Some nightmares. Hey. All right. Well, I think that's a fantastic place to go ahead and pause here. Pretty good start to the Walking Dead game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I really enjoyed recording it and talking over it for you. If you've liked this content and you want to get more of it on time in an orderly fashion, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Go ahead and leave me a comment on down below what you think is going to happen now that we've got a good taste of what's going on in the Walking Dead universe with Lee and Clementine and Herschel Green and Sean. Uh, we might, the, the next character, I'm not going to spoil his name yet, but he's a pretty cool character that we're about to meet. Uh, and don't forget to like the video. Uh, I'd really appreciate all the likes, the subscribes, the comments, everything you guys have been doing recently. It really uh, keeps the, the passion going for this. So I'll see you guys in the next Walking Dead, the game video.